When did you realize that everything would be okay for you? Hmm. Ooh, I like that question. Oh, wow. Oh, man. What about me makes you proud? What was the best memory of high school? It's finding, it was finding communities and schools. What was your first impression of me when we met? Oh my goodness. You were so little and sweet. <laughs> <laughs> you were one of the first students I met when I started with communities and schools. So I think I was a little overwhelmed at first when I met you. Ooh, this one better be great, okay? What makes you proud about me? Okay, um, <laughs> anyway. <gasps> Uh, oh <laughs> I mean, so many people give up, like, so they're one step away from their dreams coming true. And I've seen people do that all throughout my life. And to watch you arrive at each one of your dreams and, like, kick the front door in, you know what I'm saying? Like, that just, that makes me so proud of you. My turn. What were the challenges you were facing when you met me? Um, at that time, I don't know if I told you, but um, I live in a two bed, one bath house mm -hmm. with a multifamily structure. So it was my parents, my mom and dad, my four siblings, including me, my aunt and her three children, and my grandparents. I was just lost. I was depressed. I was lost. Um, I was angry. One of the challenges in that time was my, my ex-boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> right, yeah. Communities and schools is amazing, but like, you're, you're the reason why. You know what I'm saying? It's you, it's specifically you. You changed my life. You gave me lots of hope, you know, lots of hope for the future. Community school is full of chosen people with pure hearts. If this was to be our very last conversation, what would you want me to know? Um, thank you for teaching me how to handle stress, how to handle struggles. Thank you for realizing something I didn't have that you saw in me. <sighs> Thank you for being there. Thank you for everything. To actually go to college and know that I could do it and be somebody in this world, like there's actually nobody ever that's been there for me like consistently, you know, and I would, I would honestly have to say thank you, you know, and I, I love you so much.